After many months of careful excavation, the big dig is complete and it's now that the building starts to rise from its foundation. With such a large building, the pilings that support the basement slab and provide load bearing for the columns, lifts and stairs are essential. What we're doing today is we're going to be testing the foundations to ensure that they, they satisfy the load that they're designed to carry. We're going to be using a 20 tonne drop hammer and I put a set of force gauges onto the, onto the pile that we're measuring and from that, with the gauges, we measure the reaction force coming back up and we work out what the pile capacity is. We're going to be dropping the 20 tonne drop hammer at about, about a metre drop height and we're hoping to put a force of about 15,000 kilonewtons into the pile and depending on how, how far the pile moves, we'll determine how much pile capacity there is. At the moment we've got precast panels that have been installed that are forming uh, the core on site. We've got a lot of activity happening with excavations in the ground and concrete pourings with our local suppliers. Um, so we're very excited that the project is moving along and we're making some good progress. So it's an exciting phase of the project where uh, we're seeing the first of the vertical structures emerge from the depths of the basement. Uh, the community is genuinely interested in the progress uh, and what's happening on the project and uh, we're really excited today to have our partners in Fed Uni on site uh, with a group of their students who are conducting a, a building construction course. And we're able to share with them um, our challenges that we're facing with compliance around the timber structure in particular, but also construction techniques that we're using. Deep basement construction is unique in Ballarat and um, we look forward to having them back in a couple of months time when the, when the timber structure is starting to go up. People from the Fred Uni really had a, a great interest in the project. Um, to actually see them interact and ask questions was you know, a great knowledge sharing uh, with the locals, particularly you know, looking at those people that will be coming through the industry very shortly and hopefully the next project in, uh, in, in Ballarat that has more timber. In the next video we take our first look at the timber structure that's been manufactured in Italy. Stay tuned for more video updates on this exciting project.